Hobby people, I'm back with another video and today I'm super excited because Melody Susie reached out to me to review one of their newest nail drills. Um, I absolutely love Melody Susie nail drills and it is for their anniversary. I want to wish Melody Susie a 14 year anniversary. Happy 14 year anniversary. That is really amazing. That's quite the accomplishment um, in this industry. So yeah y'all, let's hop into this new nail drill. So this here is the nail drill. Um, that they sent me it is a part of their M series and it's um, M B four five zero E nail drill um, And it shows here they've been in business since 2009. So yeah, that's really awesome You all already know I love Melody Susie packaging has their logo here really clean sleek to the point kind of chic and then on the back here it talks about the nail drill um, it gives the model again what the input is the output is and it is maximum power of 28 watts So let's go ahead and get into this unboxing. I'm really excited about this I just again that packaging is so nice. I see it's all nice and padded up here really really nice Okay, so this here is the instructions for the drill definitely make sure you all are new to using e-drills to go ahead and go through read the instructions um, so that you make sure that you're using the item properly. This here talks about all the different drill bits and what they're used for. And this tells more information about how to operate the drill. So definitely make sure you take your time go through and read the instruction manual. Okay, here is the drill itself. Okay, and then underneath it, it has all the pieces for the drill. Okay, everything's in their own little individual boxes. I'm going to just take everything out here. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start with all the accessories for the drill. I think they're all in this box here. Oh, nice. I love these extra drill bits that they come with. Okay, so this one comes with this um, carbide bit. This looks like it's a coarse one too. So it comes with this uh, barrel carbide bit. That's really nice. I don't think I have any bits like this. So that's pretty cool. I like this would be good for like hard gel and acrylics and things like that. Then it comes with this um, cylinder uh, bit here. That's what that looks like. Okay. And this one's also very coarse. Okay. It also comes with this really nice hand piece, and this one here feels like it's kind of made of a little bit of like hard silicone. It has a rubberized, a rubberized texture to it, so that's really nice. We have here the charger for the drill, the piece that clips onto the side of the drill, and all of these really cool drill bits. Wow. Yeah, these are really nice. Looks like a nice selection of drill bits here. Hmm. Okay, so... Okay, very cool. So these are all the drill bits that come with this particular set. What's interesting is, is that they didn't include a mandrel bit, which most drill bits do come with. So I don't know, I guess they figure people have enough mandrel bits, so they need a variety of other ones. But here are all the different bits here. Um, these bits I'm really starting to appreciate more for gel X nails to get right up into that cuticle area to file the nails down along with these ones here to add pre etch um, nail tips all of these drill bits are really good and, and have their own good particular uses and this one i think is also good for after you're done like filing your nails and just cleaning away any dust and debris so loving the variety here this is a really sharp tip loving the variety of the different nail tips okay now let's look at the handle for it Ooh, it's nice and slim. I like this. I like the footprint on this. So this is a really nice and slim um, hand piece for the drill. Very small and comfortable to the hand. Really, really nice. I like that. And this is where you lock and unlock. So I'll unlock it and remove this little safety piece here that most drills come with. I'm thinking maybe I'll give this drill a bit of go. I've never actually used it before. So I'll be interested to see how it works. So I'll put this one in and lock it. So now the drill bit is locked in place, okay? And then last but not least is the actual drill itself. Very pretty. 
Yeah, this is really nice. It's sleek. It's small. It's a very, very small footprint, about the size of my hand. Okay. And um, I'm loving this um, pink slash rose gold color that they have. Over here is the side where you can decide where to clip it on. So this is where this piece goes. So I'm going to clip this into place like so. And then here's a clip if you are a nail tech and you travel and you want to have it on your belt. Um, at the bottom here, it talks more about the drill. Um, pretty much the same information that was on the um, box. And then here is where you uh, put your hand piece in. And then this says forward and backward. And then that's the power. So I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. Like so. Okay, so it is now plugged in. And then I'm going to go ahead and turn it on, okay? Okay, I guess it doesn't have any charge, so it needs to charge. So I'm going to plug it in really quick. Oh. I don't know if you guys can see on here, but it's showing that it's already fully charged. Let's see if you can see that on the screen. Okay, so let's see if I unplug it. Oh, okay all right so let me unplug it so you have to press it down to turn it on and off but the display on the screen is really really light you can barely see it so you press it down and now it's showing that it's on and that it's paused with the full charge huh it's showing that it's on you guys and it's not moving at all that's interesting See if this may be being uh, uh. to it there. Oh, there it is. Okay, there it is. Yeah, it's hard to see the display on the screen. I can I can barely see it and it's in person. But right now it's at zero RPM. When you turn it on, this is it at two RPM, 14 RPM, 35 RPM. So I mean, for the most part, it's fairly silent. There's no vibrations. It still feels very like comfortable in the hand. Yeah, it's a really nice drill. Even at 35 at its highest power, it doesn't feel uncomfortable to hold or maneuver. But, um, like I said, I, the, the display, I can barely see it, you guys. Like, and I'm looking at it in person, but right now it's at 5 RPM. It says the battery is at a full charge, so I'm a little confused on that. But, okay, let's get into testing the drill, okay? So I do have here my Melody Susie Dust Collector. Do you have a dedicated review on this? I will leave it linked down in the description box below in case you guys want to check it out. And this here is a nail tip that I just need to file off um, the polish on. So I'm going to go ahead and turn on my nail drill here. Okay. And I'll go ahead maybe like, um, I'll do 10 RPM. Well, I'm going to do 15 RPM, actually. Okay. So the drill is at 15 RPM, and I'm going to go ahead and file off this product, okay? Powerful. I even think I can go faster. I'm going to take it to 20 RPM. Very smooth to work with. Oh, 
Wow, I am quite impressed you guys. That ate right through that gel polish that was on that nail tip, that is awesome. It ate right through that gel polish like in 2.5 seconds and it left a smooth surface like to be able to put like another polish on. I feel like other times when I filed off nail tips like this, um, it left a rough surface, but this one left a smooth surface, which is pretty cool. I actually quite enjoyed this drill bit. I've never actually used it before, but it seems like it'd be really nice for um, filing, shaping the nail in, and also getting off gel products. So final thoughts on this drill is, yes, I love it. I think it's a great drill. Um, the only thing that um, I would say that I didn't like is the fact that I cannot see the screen at all. So right now it's actually on, but I can't, I can barely see the numbers. So I don't know if there's like an adjustment for the lightness of the screen or darkness of the screen, but I think that's something that, um, that I think could be improved upon. And then also having to push it down to turn it on and off. Most nail drills, you just twist it and turn it on and off. So it was um, interesting that they added a feature to press it to turn it on and off. But outside of that, it's a great drill. It's a really nice drill. It's very powerful and uh, with a very small footprint. So, I mean, again, in general, Melody Susie, they always knock it out the park when it comes to nail drills. This is no different. Again, only thing is the execution of like the design of it. See, even if I turn down my lighting, Okay. Well, I guess when you turn down the lighting, you can see it. So maybe my lighting was just too bright. It's so okay. You guys, can you guys see it now? Okay. So maybe you can't work with it in bright lights, I guess. I don't know. Because now I can see the lighting. I can see it a lot better. Oh, it's paused. Oh, okay. Yeah, this really is to stop on off. Okay. Maybe that's what it was. Okay, and that's how you pause it and run it. Okay, all right. Well, maybe it's just the lighting in my. Uh, maybe the lighting was just too. Maybe the lighting was just too bright. But now I can actually see the display. So just keep that in mind when you're trying to use the drill. If you all are interested in this nail drill, I do have a discount code on this drill. I will leave it here on the screen as well as in the description box below, along with any other products that I mentioned in today's video, in case you guys are interested in getting your hands on it. Um, I do recommend it, um, but again, I don't know if everybody else who got this drill has the same thing with that screen. Another special thanks to Melody Susie for sending this over for review. Again, I'm gonna leave everything linked down in the description box below, along with a dedicated playlist list that I have for all Melody Susie products and reviews on their products um, and I do upload every Tuesday Thursday and Saturday if you all like what you saw here definitely stick around join the happy family I love to have you and as always you guys leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video I hope you all have a wonderful awesome spectacular day bye